All right, we are back with another episode of Daddy's Kitchen, you guys. All right, Daddy. <laughs> we are back, we are back, we are back with another walkthrough tutorial. Daddy, without further ado, tell the people them what we're cooking today in Daddy's Kitchen. Curry chicken. Curry chicken. All right, so before we like waste any more time, I don't waste any time, we need to get straight to it because I know you guys are hungry. What are we doing here, Daddy? We're gonna wash the chicken. Wash the chicken. So you guys already know how it is on Daddy's Kitchen channel. You guys are gonna be able to watch us go through the steps of how to make this. If you are a beginner, if you are someone who's not, maybe not a beginner, but you just don't know how to make curry chicken, at least you know the steps. And the first step is always wash your chicken. Wash your meat. Vinegar. So vinegar, right, Daddy? And what else? Lemon. And some lemon. So as you can see, there's some vinegar and water, and then there's also some lemon. And don't be shy. Get in there and rub a dub dub like how you would rub a dub dub yourself in the shower. You want to make sure that you know the meat that you're eating is clean, guys, especially with the world how it is nowadays and everything that's going around. You want to make sure you give your meat a good clean before you start cutting it up, right, Daddy? Wow. For those of you guys who are new to the channel, welcome to the channel. This is my dad, who I call Daddy, or who we all call Daddy. Welcome to the family. And I am Sasha, and Daddy has been teaching me since we started quarantine how to cook because we were off and we just figured, Sasha, you have no excuses. And so I've been taking my whole following with me and all my new family members, so I'm excited to have you guys here. So welcome to the fam. All right, you still washing, Daddy? Yeah. A wash, you see, guys. Not just one wash. Not two just wash, one wash. Two, wash. two wash, three wash. Okay. <laughs> All right. Next step. So next step, Daddy. What are we doing? We gotta cut the chicken in half. Like, I guess you're not supposed to be tender with it at all. No, nope, you don't play with it. <laughs> <laughs> No playing around, clearly. <laughs> Cut the fats off. Cutting all the fat off, you guys. And I'm gonna take off all the skins. Okay. Because it's curry chicken. So curry chicken, you're not leaving the skin off? No. Okay. What is a chicken that you do leave the skin on? Jerk, right? Jerk. Uh, what else? Fried chicken. Fried chicken. Okay, but yeah. for curry, you roast get... chicken. Roast chicken. But for curry, you take off the skin. Yeah. Okay. I take the skin out. Some people don't. Some people... Like... Yeah, I think I've seen people leave the skin out. I don't really care for skin on curry chicken. I agree. It's not the most common thing. All right. Okay. Like that. You got another cut? You cut even smaller pieces for curry chicken. Usually they're in like little quarters, right? Okay. So if it's a thigh, like right here, it's half a thigh. If it's a leg, it's like half a leg. Okay, I feel you. And obviously you guys gotta make sure your knife is sharp. sharp. Daddy's is getting dull, right, Daddy? Yeah, I need a new knife. <laughs> All right, wing. You're not gonna get much off your wing. Yeah, so you just leave the wing as is, right? I leave that wing for you. Thank you. <laughs> I love me some wings. All right, Daddy, so what is the next step? So all of the chicken is already cooked. You know, I mean, not cooked. What am I talking cut. about? <laughs> all of the chicken is already cut up and ready to go, you guys. So now, what we're doing? I'm gonna put the spices together. I'm gonna put everything in one. Okay, so what do we have going in first? Seasoning salt. Seasoning salt. Also spoonful. I don't like enough salt. 
Yeah, we, need, we need some salt in our curry chicken, though, man. Yeah, this is salt. That's all, not all, there's a little salt in there on most of these things. That's, so, what, that's what you guys always say. Yeah, man. When right. you, when, What's that? Onion powder. Onion powder. My parents are super healthy and like cut down on the salt for cholesterol and all those reasons. It's for everybody. For everybody. Everybody. I know, and, and we appreciate it. What's that, Daddy? All this spice? Is garlic plus. Garlic plus, okay. Flavo. Flavo, Daddy's favorite, or Flavo rice. Seasoning. The seasoning. His favorite. It's that one from Costco. All purpose, purpose seasoning. seasoning. Vegeta. Vegeta. Vegetarian. Mm -hmm. Enough of a And ginger powder. Ginger powder. Flavor. Okay. And so this is pimento seeds. Pimento. All-purpose all, all seeds. All right, pimento. This is very good. Of course. Very good. I'm gonna just put it in the meat just like that. Oh, did you see that, you guys? Throwing in the meat there. Now I'm going to mix this up together. Okay. Now we're going to mix it all up together. All of our things. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I should put some love... paprika in it. Yes. Where's my pretty sister paprika? How could he forget you? Pretty sister paprika. Sister paprika. Yeah. Sister paprika. You did it. Give it like a color. Oh wow, look how beautiful paprika is. I always say this, if you guys have been following me, or Daddy's Kitchen, sorry, for as long as it's ever been up, you know how I feel about paprika. The pretty sister, the pretty spice. <laughs> All of mercy. <laughs> That's obviously my dad's favorite line also. <laughs> That's the color for the line. He's merciful. Always. He's a source of everything. Always. I love how Daddy mixes the seasonings inside the bowl. Like that's that's a more newer type of thing, Maria. As you start, do Daddy. Yeah, like ma. it. Okay. Rather than just individually, individually, individually mixing it all together so it's fully like mixed and then evenly distributed amongst all your chicken for the flavor. Come on. Yes. I'm going to coat the meat with a little oil. Okay, so you're coating the meat with a little bit of oil. What kind of oil was that? Vegetable oil. Vegetable oil. Okay. And you said that you do this because it kind of pulls in the flavors more once you season it, right? Makes it seep in and soak in and... Okay. Okay, you're not going to Wow. Okay, now I'm going to season my chicken. Okay. Okay. I mean, that whole flip thing that he does, guys, I would practice with something that's not your food first. Everything would be on the floor. Before everything and up on the floor. <laughs> I'm gonna use my hand, but I'm just doing this. Okay, so you're gonna use your hands, but you're just coating as much as you can prior to the Okay, cleanliness. Yeah, no cross contamination here, y'all. Here's the secret. All right, and here is the secret. This is how it all goes down. Better pop curry in a place. Jamaican style. Jamaican style. What you mean, curry powder? Better pop. That's the brand. Genuine quality. That's the biggest pack I've ever seen you guys buy. Yeah. I love curry. We had a mission. <laughs> All right. So, is there a certain amount that you put on? Yeah, I'm going to put about two spoonfuls on this. 
you and your you know, children. You know I don't really measure, but I have... That's not a two spoonful, baby. That's about... Two two? That's about four spoonful. Jamaican spoon. Oh, yeah. You and this Jamaican spoonful. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get with my hands now. You drop the piece. Here we go. Come back. Okay. All right. It's looking delicious, you guys. What do you think? I mean, it's raw, but you already know what it is. It's looking like it's gonna be delicioso. Of course, say, hey, buddy. Yeah, man. All right. Okay. What's next? I have my seasoning for it. Okay. What do we have here? I have my thyme. Thyme. Green onions. Green onions. Peppers. Peppers. Red, green, yellow. Red, green, tomatoes, yellow, tomatoes, scotch bonnet pepper, scotch bonnet, garlic, garlic, ginger, ginger, what you say? and onions. And onions. These carrots gonna go in it after I cook it halfway. Okay, so they don't and, go in in the beginning. Yeah, and the potatoes. And the potatoes. Okay. So dice those after. Okay. Okay, so let me put my pot on. So we're gonna put the pot on right now. What did you put the pot on? Hot? Medium? Medium? High, high. High, high, high. Okay. So you get your Dutch pot, y'all. A little bit of oil, you don't need a A little nuts. bit of vegetable oil, not too, too much. Fire on high because that chicken is going in. Okay? All right, daddy. Now burn some curry. Now, okay, so this is the part. This is the part that you guys got to pay attention to. And if you guys watched the uh, curry goat tutorial, then you would have seen this also. But whenever there is curry involved, especially Jamaican style, we're gonna show you what you gotta do first before you start making the chicken. And that is burning the curry, right, burn Daddy? Curry. Or, curry can make your belly run. And if you don't burn the curry, your belly, I gonna run you, right? This is your belly right here. Strong right, belly. This is your yeah. belly. If it don't run, you have a strong belly. And if it don't run, you have a strong, strong belly. Okay, I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Or if you need to wash out. But... It's good, you clean out anyway. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. So as that heats up, Daddy, what are we going to do? We... So you put just take the curry and, 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 and you just put it in there. Okay, yeah. waiting for it. Let's wait for it to heat up. Real time, real time. All right, so let's see how it all goes down. All right, let's see what's in the spoon first. What would you call that, Daddy? How much? Two spoonfuls. Oh, funny. Anyways. <laughs> okay, this is how you burn curry, guys. This is what they mean when they say burn curry. So the oil was in there. It was hot. We just literally put two tea tablespoons, as Daddy says, of the curry in the pot mix it up with the oil and now we're just allowing it to kind of sit there and burn for lack of better terms very interesting okay okay now the chicken now the chicken goes in Cover that bad boy up and we let it sit, correct? Yeah, it's water, this. Put some water in there, give it a little rings, rings, and then put it into the pot. Wash out all the ingredients. This is a technique, you guys. Look, all that, all that's gonna go in the pot. That's flavor right there. Flavor. Lord of mercy. Daddy, what? <laughs> Funny. 
heart of our skin. My dad's been saying that since we were children. All right, so what's happening over here? Now we're gonna cut up the veg. You guys can hear that pot in the background, right? Pull, pull, pull. Steaming. Cutting up those greens, those orange bell peppers, yellow bell peppers. Gonna move on to the onions and the garlic and the tomato. And I'm gonna catch you guys when we're opening for our first checkup on the chicken. All right, so our first checkup. All righty. Let's run this chicken. Get a good grip of the pot. being done. Are you adding something to it right now, Daddy? Yeah. Adding the garlic. Okay. Mm. Adding the onion. Okay, this is when it starts to go off. Like it's coming along, Daddy. Of course. <laughs> I was a little afraid at first when I was like, oh, are we burning? But then I remembered the burning at the bottom. So obviously it's gonna look like that for a couple of other pieces. But it comes together because he knows what he's doing. Who am I to ask? I just caught Daddy doing a second check without me. <laughs> I was like, look at me. What's going on? So he just opened up the pot second time since we put the onions and all that good stuff in. Look at how, how different it's looking already, guys. It smells flipping delicious, that's for sure. That's obvious. 
but it's definitely coming together. Color is on a hundred. Feel like me might need a little more salt in there, you know, Daddy. Me not smell no salt. You can't smell the salt. You need to taste it. I'm telling you, I can't smell the salt. I can't smell the salt. And it seemed like there's not much in there. Okay, so now you're adding the rest of the seasoning. Okay. How long has this pot been on the fire approximately, Daddy? What, 20 minutes? 15, 20 minutes. And the chicken already looks like it's almost cooked. It does not take long to cook. Okay, guys, this is a meal that does not take long to cook. And yes, maybe, you know, we're recording, we're talking, we're doing all that good stuff, but I'm telling you, this is a meal that, what, max steady from start to finish for curry chicken? 20, 20 25 minutes. 20, 25 minutes, right? Because I can't believe that this is almost already done, and it seems like we just started. We making this with white rice, right, huh? Yeah. Yeah, the only way to have it. First of all, you guys, if you are not a Jamaican, you need to know. If you're going to have curry, there's rules to this bad boy. I know that there's some people who like curry with rice and peas, but no. I prefer curry, and a lot of Jamaicans and a lot of people prefer curry on a white rice. That is the best way to have it, in my opinion. Not true, daddy. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. So, like, something like oxtail tastes good with white rice, too, but it tastes better with rice and peas, in my opinion. You know, there's certain things for certain rice dips. With gravy. With gravy. With some oxtail gravy. Who's washed our, 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 wait, do we have a, a oxtail one up yet, Daddy? We don't. I don't think we have an oxtail one up on the channel. I think oh, we, don't? I don't think so. It's I think on Instagram. It's only a, look at you on Instagram. That really? is so cute. Really? Well, you know about Instagram, yeah. On your Instagram. It's on Instagram? On mm -hmm. my Instagram. Not even on your Instagram. You are teaching me. <laughs> oh, this is so funny. The way you said Instagram. I don't think my dad's ever said Instagram to me without me saying it first. That's hilarious. Okay, so yeah. I think we need a, a oxtail mm -hmm. tutorial on the YouTube channel, oh Betty. We gotta refilm that. I'm looking at anything I don't see. I can't really believe I don't have one. Yeah, because in your head you already thought that it was done because it was done, remember, during quarantine on my page. But now we got to bring it to our YouTube family. Yeah. Even Aki and Selfish, they got it on my page, but they don't have it on our YouTube family. There's so many things that we don't have oh on our YouTube. Goodness. All right, so you guys heard it here. We're going to get it together, Oxtail and... Aki and Selfish is coming up. Make sure you put in the comments below what meals you want to see on Daddy's Kitchen. What meals do you want him to help us learn how to make immediately, like yesterday? And we will get started. And in the meantime, make sure that you're liking, commenting, and subscribing to Daddy's Kitchen channel. Tell them, Daddy. <laughs> make sure you're subscribing to the channel right down below and turn on that post notification because you need to know when you are when we drop another video right like who doesn't want to be a good cook you're trying to roll in the boys or roll in the women or secure the bag or you know lose some weight gain some weight eat healthier whatever it may be you got to learn how to cook in your own kitchen and daddy's kitchen is here to help you do that. So young subscribe. Man, young man, you need to learn oh. to cook. Oh. For your oh. wife. Oh. And I oh. And I oh. I didn't even for see that one wife. coming. Tell them again, Daddy, because we're always stressing out Uman them. Always young a stress man, on Uman them. You need to learn to cook. Hello. For your wife. Amen. Lord of mercy. Lord of mercy. <laughs> All right. Third check in the building. Oh my God, guys. Ooh so Daddy chopped up the potatoes and the carrots yes. and he kind of diced them, right Daddy? They're yes. like a diced type size. Sliced up the, okay? And remember guys, this doesn't go in the beginning, it goes in now. This is the third check after it's almost ready because you don't want it to squish out, mash out. Because if you put it from the beginning, they won't even be there by the end, right? They'll just boil out into your gravy, and you don't want that. You want to be able to have your little potatoes and your carrots while you're eating your chicken. 
Not true, Daddy. Yeah, Perfect. It smells so good. Oh. Turn the heat back up. Carrots and potatoes. I put in, just stop it from boiling. So I turn it back up. Okay. So when it started to boil up, oh, again, because you threw everything in and it was yeah, cold, it kind of cup. brought it down yeah. from brought boiling. The temperature. temperature. Okay, yeah. so you turn it back up a little bit so it can be boiling again. Okay, yeah. I follow the drip. See, we're making it sauce really good. The gravy is getting nice and thick. Alright, we cover in again. Oh, you want to see more? <laughs> <laughs> okay. See you later. <laughs> Alright, is this our final check, buddy? Kind of? Alright. Alright, alright, alright. How you feeling? Good. Feeling good? Alright, awesome. let's see how good. We feel it in the pot. Jeez. Whoa, you guys. Whoa. 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 You just check the, the potato? Three more minutes. Three more minutes based off of the checking of that potato. Yeah. Wow. Talent. Three more minutes you here, guys. Tree and leaf. Leaf and tree. Three more minutes. You want some, guys? You got to find me. <laughs> you got to <laughs> find me. You got to find me. Do you guys want the spices still? That's our question for you. Do you guys really want Daddy's Kitchen spices? When should the date drop be for Daddy's Kitchen spices? Because we've been getting a lot of requests from day one. And we've been thinking on it, but we want to make sure that the, that the demand is there. Are you guys really interested in all of the spices that Daddy puts together? Because I know a lot of you guys are saying that you don't have access to all those spices. You know, they're not sold in the U.S. or they're not sold where you are. Let us know if you want Daddy to make his original blend of spices so that you guys can order them. Pot looks amazing, Daddy. Yeah. Three more minutes. Three more minutes. All right. We'll be back. You got gravy? I see that gravy. Yeah, all over your rice. All over your rice. All right. Daddy says that the pot has completed. It is done. This is the final level. We have won the curry chicken battle. <laughs> you guys look how good this looks i can't wait to have some let's get it shared out on the plate so you guys can eat Peace and love always.